The legacy of the Divine Nine is that they saw so many inequities, just like we have now. Voting rights, women's rights, health care. They saw a need to be strong as a unit, as a member of their sorority or their fraternity, but they knew that if they worked together, they could do even more. Many of us have short-term memories. We forget the significance of contributions of any person, but let alone Black Americans, African Americans, and how integral of a role African Americans have played in the history of this nation. Black history is American history, and we should celebrate it every day. It's an acknowledgement, an acknowledgement of all of the triumphs and also all of the dark moments, and then that we're gonna to continue to move forward together in progress. Exposure is everything. It's to be able to see HBCUs perform, to see the Divine Nine perform, and to see us on a stage like this, hopefully it inspires them to want to go to college and become a part of one of our organizations. The work that we do collectively is something to talk about and something to celebrate. If you look back at any point in history and you look at black excellence, nine times out of 10, you're talking about someone who's been a part of one of our D9 organizations. We have different colors, different crests and shields, but the same mission. When one of us wins, we all win. When we come together, we create the opportunity to shift culture and to really be the answers that this world needs right now. We've seen a lot of things really transpire here in the United States. So now more than ever, we need each other. We need to heal each other. We need to address those concerns. And that's what the Divine Nine is about. The Divine Nine is making sure that we're tied to our communities, that we can actually uplift each other. It's important to uplift each other because if we don't, who will?